Hello everyone and welcome to Live Blogger. So in this video, I'm going to tell you a very easy and simple way that you can use to change or add a fav icon to your website. Now, as all of you know, a fav icon is the main ingredient in making your website get that extra little finishing touch and making it look extremely professional and really, really well made. So before we get started, quickly hit that like button, subscribe to the channel and let's get started with the video. So before we can actually add a fav icon or create a fav icon for our site, what we have to do is actually make a fav icon, right? Or actually generate a fav icon. And for that, we will go to an icon generator site. The best one in our opinion is favicon.io. Go there and open it. The link will be provided in the description. Then we will reach the dashboard of the site. We will have a bunch of buttons on the top. We will have a very easy process to actually get this all done. And the way that I'm going to tell you is not using an image, but by doing it from scratch, right? So it is a very easy method using this site. Once we have reached the dashboard, all we have to do is click the button on the top that says generate. Then we reach this page where we have a lot of things, but do not get confused. Okay. This is very easy to create. We will see a bunch of colors. We will see a bunch of fields on the left on, on this page. You will have a lot of options. You can change the text. You can change the background. You can change the font of your text. You can change the font color, the background color. There will be a whole bunch of options. So this is where you really want to spend a lot of time and you want to perfect your fav icon from this page itself. This is the main page of your website. And this is where you probably want to be spending a lot of time trying to perfect your fav icon because this is basically it. And this will be locked in into your site. So right here for now, what I'm going to do is just add a little bit of text, just mess around with the values a little bit, just as an example, but you want to get it exactly the way you want. Once you have it exactly how you like it, what you want to do is go up and you will see three buttons. One says share, one says save and one says download. But in order to add it to our website on blogger, we need to click on the download button. Once you click the download button, it will open up your file explorer. You can choose where you want to save it, desktop, D drive, C drive, whatever drives you have. Click save and it is completely saved on your PC. The fav icon that you have generated will be a WinRAR file. So what you need to do is go to your desktop and click on it, right click on it and click extract and then extract it. That will create a normal folder, not a WinRAR zip archive that you can open. Then in order to set it up, we go to blogger.com. You click on the sign in button or you register, you sign in, you enter your credentials, you sign into the website, you enter your username, password, whatever you have set it up. And once you do all of that, then we will continue on with the rest of the steps. So once your blogger.com or blog dashboard has opened up, what you want to do is look at the buttons on the site. There will be a button that says settings. You want to click on that settings button and inside in the sub menus, you want to click on the fav icon button that will open up a different page. And then there'll be an option called choose file and you choose the file that you have downloaded and extracted. Again, only choose the file that you have extracted and not the file that you had directly downloaded. Choose your file, hit open and that will open up. Then all you have to do is click the orange save button and you are completely done. Quick, you just have to click the save button and that is it. The window won't close automatically. There won't be anything special, but all you have to do is just click that button. And when you go back onto your dashboard, and you click on your website to actually see if the fav icon is there. And if it is not there by any chance, then don't worry. Your fav icon has been put in. It just takes a little bit of time for blogger to process it around about 10 to 20 minutes, wait that much, and then check back again to see if your fav icon is already there. And that is literally it to generate a fav icon from the start and put it up on blogger.com. If you like this video, please hit that like button. Do consider subscribing to the channel. This is Live Blogger and we'll see you in our next video.